Hey guys, welcome back to Elan App. For today's video, we are going to show you Hubai tutorial. So if you're interested, let's start tutorial. In this case, how do you use Hubai here? Well, using Hubai is actually fairly easy. So first things first, go to their official website and we want to go ahead and sign up. So at the top right of the screen, go ahead and click on sign up. And from here, you can go ahead and enter your details manually or you could even use your Google account to sign up with your, in this case, Hubai. In this case, let's go ahead and click on continue with Google, choose our Google account here to proceed and just hit on continue. Now from here, what we need to do next is we just need to basically start buying. In this case, the great thing about Hubai here is they actually have a search bar that we can do. So in this case, the first thing you see here is going to be some pop-ups. You can go ahead and read them, but I'm going to agree to their, uh, their terms here. Let's go ahead and click on agree and continue, but I suggest you to read fully their descriptions or their information here. But in this case, you could go ahead and start searching for products. In this case, well, you first need to understand how actu uh, things actually work here. So Hubai actually uh, allows you to place some orders here and your orders will be delivered to a warehouse. And in the warehouse, you could do some quality assurance here and basically check if the product is up to par. Now, once it, it is actually, or in this case has passed quality assurance, they will ship this to your doorstep or in your area. In this case, let's go ahead and start buying. In this case, let's go ahead and maybe search for a shoe. Let's press and enter. Now from here, let's go ahead and click on accept. So in this case, all products for us found are sourced from third parties. So in this case, just give you the idea here, the products that you'll be seeing here are from third parties. So in this case, go ahead and select the products. So for example, I want to get one of the products here. So in this case, for example, this one. Let's go ahead and click on it. Now it should open up a new tab here, which in this case, you'll see a bunch of details about the product itself. In this case, there are going to be some information about this one. So in this case, uh, these are products from 1688. So in this case, there are going to be some uh, details that you need to know. Like for example, no detail product quality, uh, quantity check, limited sampling infection, in inspection service, and limited after sale service. But let's, get, let's go and click on I have a re uh, read and agreed, agreed and above and click on a confirm. Now, in this page here, you can view a few things here, like the details, some of the sizes, and the quantity that you could buy here. Also the number of sales that this product actually made. Now in this case, you could go ahead and uh, basically uh, inspect the product itself. So if you wanted to view more, you could go ahead and scroll down a bit here, view the product details, how it looks like, the specification, uh, in this case, the parameters, the shopping agent guy here if you want, and the after sales service if you want to read that. But in this case, since we are now good with this one, let's go ahead and click on add to cart here. And also you need to agree in the agree re read and agree the above here. But for now, let's go and click on Add to Cart. In this case, you could do this for all products that you want to buy. But once you've added all the products in your cart, go and click on the cart icon at its top right of the screen. Now, in this case, the first thing you want to do here is you want to notice that there are going to be multiple steps that you need to do here. So again, like what I said before, it's a whole process here, which in this case, you need to select the products they want to buy. So let's go and select this one. And you could go and click on Submit. Now, also, if you want to get an estimate on what you'll be paying for this specific product here, you could go ahead and click on Estimator. And you can change the operation here. So let's just say this is going to be for shoes. Let's go ahead and choose the running shoes here. Click on confirm. In this case, you could choose who, what, where, who by warehouse that you want to send to. So in this case, maybe I want to say Australia here. And let's go ahead and click on inquire. Now, the great thing about the uh, estimator here, it allows you to see, uh, or in this case, uh, determine how much you'll be paying. So in this case, this is going to be for you to know what is going to be the uh, the deli delivery fee here and some of the charges that you might incur here. So in this case, you could choose and estimate what you want. So in this case, we have our uh, type of transport here and a lot. So in this case, you can go and click on inquire here if you want further, but let's go and click on back to card. In this case, once you've selected your products here, let's go and click on submit. Now next is you want to confirm your product. So you need to provide your address here. And once you provide your address here, you could go ahead and add extra services. So if you want to add like extra photos for quality check here, you could go ahead and do that. So in this case, you could go ahead and describe how you want it, or in this case, the photo that you want to add here. So in this case, there are going to be some fees for extra services here. In this case, once you provide your address here and the uh, following details for your product here, you should be able to start paying for it on the next page. 
And on the next page, once you paid for it, they will send this to your warehouse, which in this case, once the uh, products arrive to your warehouse, you should be able to do a quality check or inspection. So they will be sent, they will be sending you, informing you some images they need to do here. And once you approve that, you could go ahead, they will be sending this parcels to you. And in this case, you need to pay for international shipping here. Now, from then on, you just need to wait for it. And that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to LandApp. Thank you for watching.